information has been doubling at a much rapid pace uh, relative to the whole computing power at the pace which with computing power has been doubling. Now if I look at it parallelly there is a lot of advancement that's have, that's been happening in the business intelligence and data warehousing space where information is the crux of the uh, whole stack. So if I look at the entire end to end components, so on the front end if you look at organizations are able to really leverage business analytics much more than they would have done several years back. There are a lot of advancements in bringing predictive capability, forward looking capability. Uh, if you look at the reporting and visualization, there are a lot of advancements in terms of how data is presented, how you make it easy for the masses to consume uh, data, reports, metrics and so on and so forth. From the perspective of the core architecture, advancements like data warehouse appliances are really making it easy uh, to get a pre-built uh, infrastructure and components to rapidly get up and running, reduce the end-to-end -end cycle, and start putting a model that can scale. Now from a scalability standpoint, cloud computing is other angle that is very rapidly coming into the mix with the back-end data store and uh, some of the other services uh, enabling more of a service-based model where I can defer my scalability requirements or upfront investments to a later stage but then leverage uh, the, leverage the foundation aspects, uh, whether it's through external sources or internal cloud. So advances are happening in multiple fronts. BI is the next uh, exciting area. Now, you know, you also need to look at business performance management, BI combination, BI, SOA combinations to look at how really services are being enabled, how BI is able to bring the closed loop mix with the process, workflow, and so on and so forth and overall making the whole integration uh, problem very simple.